Hello, Pisces. Getting ready to do your reading. All right, Ace of Swords and flying off to the side. Oh, your cards want to talk, Pisces. All right. Making a decision about love, nine of coins. Okay, so you are going to have communication from someone. Someone's going to speak their truth. So you're going to get a confession, communication. Under the deck right now is the magician. All right, so all of those fell out. Ace of Swords was first. So this is someone speaking their truth about how they feel about you. <clears throat> and you are the nine of coins, so you're in a good place. At least that's how they're viewing you. This could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or just good news with the Page of Wands. All right, so let's see the past. Okay, it could have been a fire sign or an earth sign, but again, this is kind of like a, to me, not, not a very good offer when I see the Knight of Coins. So, or maybe this person was really slow. Maybe they didn't want to be in a relationship, you know. So it could be that this is the same person, and now they are going to tell you how they truly feel. Now maybe they're ready to move forward. In the past, they were really slow. Okay. okay, so they may have a fear of commitment or they did, but it looks like maybe they're moving away from that. Yeah, this person is taking action. This is what was under the deck. So whoever this is, they want to, you know, tell you something, move the relationship forward, even the sun's under the deck right now. Take action. Justice is here, so again, possibly possibly engagement or marriage, but it's definitely some type of committed relationship. Um, let me see the outcome where this is headed. Moving very quickly. Let me do one more, four of coins, okay. Hmm. We'll see why that's that's the outcome. A page of Cups is under there. Um, we have your energy here, Pisces, Libra, Cancer, could be a fire or an earth sign. Okay, what is this Ace of Swords? What do they wanna tell you? Okay, so they've changed. So they're telling you they've been through a huge transformation. Something has changed in their life. This might be that they're not telling you the moon and four of coins. Maybe they're not going to tell you what happened. Maybe someone in their life has died even, but they have learned from that or they have, you know, realized, yeah, look at how carefree they are. Like they realize that maybe they were holding back. They didn't realize how precious life really is possibly, but there's definitely been a change. They've been through something and they're ready to take this next step with you. What is the Eight of Swords? Whoops, Five of Wands, Conflict, Page of Coin, Page of Cups. Okay, so again, this is about not wanting to move forward, being stuck. Two of you are communicating here, but you are arguing. They don't want to move forward. That was the past though. They were not willing to move forward, but now things, let's go to the moon and see why. We can find out what has happened behind the scenes. Five of Swords, Ace of Coins, Hierophant. Again, Fool's under there. So with the Five of Swords, I almost get like they are fighting for your love. Like they don't want anyone else to have you. They want to give you this big giant coin. Before it was this little coin. Now to me, it's much bigger. This is a proposal. This is uh, wanting to spend you know, the rest of their life with you. Something has, has truly changed. So if you're watching this Pisces and this resonates, this person has been through something. They have been through a major transformation. And they may not want to share it though with the four of coins. In fact, they're maybe coming back in very quickly, not wanting to lose you. It's like they value, value you more now. They realize that a relationship is important to them when before maybe they just didn't think it was. We have Leo here, Taurus and Scorpio also. What is this page of wands? Okay, so they've, well, oh, okay. So this is like a major transformation or change. Now this could be family related for some of you because 10 of coins. So maybe they walked away from family. Maybe the family did not like you. They, maybe you guys are very different. There's something about the relationship. They didn't want them with you. So this person, or they've left a relationship also, 10 of coins. It was difficult, but they moved on and they left. So I feel like they're very proud of themselves for taking this big leap, making this huge change it is pretty big with death showing up and then it's like this is transformation for this person i mean they are truly transformed this is one reading where it's very very clear okay again i just heard life is short so again they could have been in a very unhappy marriage already 
Justice is good to see in that case because it could be, you know, obviously a lawyer. I feel like though for a lot of you, this person is was not married because I feel like you may end up getting in a committed relationship with them, even engaged or married possibly very quickly with what I'm seeing here. Okay, let's go down here to Justice. Page of Swords, Nine of Cups. Wow. So again, they could be telling people like about you guys getting engaged. They can be telling people that you are their wish fulfilled. If this person in the past past has ever, you know, shied away from, you know, that they loved you or they're hiding that, they're not anymore. There could be a, a divorce or something that is finalized also. Page of Swords, Nine of Cups. I feel like that's someone communicating with the Page of Swords, being very clear. I don't feel like that's spying in this particular case. Though you could be dealing with an air sign or a Libra, but again, I feel like this is very, like this person knows what they want. Um, I'm getting like, they're very sharp. They, um, like sometimes you see readings where a person is confused or they're overwhelmed. And even though we have moon energy here, I'm feeling like this person knows exactly what, they're want, what they want. They see things very clearly right now. King of Wands in the past, worrying about you. Hmm. See, when they were in the past, and this could be even now, they're very overwhelmed. They're worried about you. They're thinking about you. They're not doing anything with the Four of Swords. So either they're trying to listen to their intuition or you are, but I actually feel like they're trying to listen to their intuition and what to do. Maybe they're worried that you would leave. All right. So this is like a major declaration of their love for you. What is the magician one last time? Let's see. Judgment, eight of wands, communication, moving forward, wheel of fortune, five of coins. They're coming towards you with an offer. Okay. Now again, there's something they walked away from. So the five of coins does not worry me because things are moving forward very quickly. So a nine of wands does not worry me because this might be a fire sign, but I always see him as someone who's very passionate. Um, you know, he's on fire. He's moving fast with this offer. This person may, they may not have, they may not, he may not have family money anymore, possibly, or people have deserted him or her, but, um, they're afraid you're not going to take their cup this time around the four of cups. They feel out in the cold without you. They feel lonely. I feel like they're making like one last attempt to reach you. They feel small. That's what I'm picking up off this. They feel kind of like, like small, like they don't have a lot to offer you. Even though their offer is really big, they don't feel like they have a lot to offer. This person has been through quite a bit emotionally and maybe physically and spiritually, but, um, Okay. Um, let me pull from a different deck for advice. Let me see. What is the what is the advice? Okay, mask. It says not showing true feelings. Hide. Personify. Pretend. Delude and gaslighting. Okay. This right here clearly tells me that someone is not telling you everything. But all of the energy around it, everything that's clarifying, tells me though that they are they're not showing how they truly feel. So they could come back more as a Knight of Wands energy. But this, the tarot shows us something very deep that has happened that has changed them. So maybe that you don't want to give them a, a second chance on how they are behaving, how they are talking. It doesn't look like things have changed. Um, because I'm getting not showing true feelings is actually they do really love you. They just don't admit it or talk about it or show you maybe they do show it with money ace of coin um so but we have the ace of cups up here i don't feel like any of the other ones really um match this person's energy at least right now in this reading i mean in the past maybe they did hide but let me see. one more message for pisces advice these cards are slippery hang on for Pisces 
and sunglasses. <laughs> Watching, looking, stalking, gas lighting again, perception, focusing out. Huh. Because we did have the page of storage, but I felt like this is them saying something. Um, not necessarily spying on you, but definitely could be, could have been. So this person is, is obsessed with you in a sense, and they have been thinking about you a lot and they have been watching you. So they're watching you a lot, spying on you, not showing or telling you how they truly feel. Maybe even gaslighting you in the past, but because it's on both cards, so it's probably important. But both of these things are hiding their face, right? Their eyes, mask, and sunglasses. Oh, wow. Okay. Let me pull. I don't feel like the romance deck is going to be very helpful, to be very honest. I don't feel like it's going to be giving us clarity, but let's see. A lot of clarity. See. Okay, getting to know each other, so that is about talking. You need to talk to this person, express your love, or they need to express love. One more, please. And release your ex. Okay, so now this could be they have an ex that they need to release, and they need to express love, and they need to communicate. Um, if they release ex, though, this feels like you. See, it's interesting because this person's, I can tell as change is coming towards you fast. Some of the cards make me feel like um, maybe some of you will not take this person back because they put you through a lot, Pisces. But I do see change. Let me pull from one other deck. Okay, let me go to the Guidance Oracle cards, what they think about this person or relationship. They're saying, look for a sign. Okay, let me pull from this deck also. Pisces, advice for Pisces. What do they need to know about this person? Okay, that says respect. So, pinnacle. We have the ace of pinnacle here and respect. I feel like they need to give you something with this ace of coin. So, whether that is an offer to get married, some type of um, gift, it seems pretty big. This is the sign that they're saying this person needs to give you to show you that they truly care. That's what I'm picking up. The sign is this, they need to give you respect in the way that they treat you and talk to you. Again, this is maybe something they're giving you, like a key. Uh, it could be anything at this point. I think it makes sense to you though. You guys know it's gonna be different. But if they give you this, that means there's respect there there's something here about this is how you know again could be respecting maybe uh respecting you in front of their family standing up for you telling people that they truly love you that they're willing to walk away from uh the family's values or beliefs to be with you okay i do feel like this person has put you through this before i feel like they come and go they say okay i'll tell them or i will break up or i'll do something in the past they never have I see here in the reading that they really have always truly wanted to with this energy here. They truly have wanted to, but they just were not courageous enough to do it. They are finally giving you the respect you deserve. It's been hard, but they are turning their back on someone or something in order to be with you. And again, this could be scary for them with the moon and four of coins. Maybe this is scarier. Maybe they're not really showing that they're scared of losing family or losing money or losing uh, you there's a lot of emotions going on underneath the surface that you're not seeing but I don't think it's bad in this reading for a lot of you I don't I think it's actually good emotion because this person has clearly coming to speak their truth and they have clearly changed something major it almost seems maybe a little bit traumatic has happened and they come out the other side changed and renewed and they're willing to like let go of people and possessions whatever it is to be with you so they may have given up like family money or family business to be with you. So it's up to you, of course, if you want to give them a chance or if it's too little, too late. But I feel like for some of you, you will be very happy. All right, Pisces, I'm going to leave it there. Have a fantastic week, and I'll talk to you soon.